The circle of life continues. It's been 25 years since Disney released The Lion King film. The 2019 version will be a reintroduction of the story to audiences around the world. Here's everything you need to know before you go. The story takes place in an African animal kingdom called the Pride Lands. The Lion King is the highest grossing 2D animation of all time in the United States. It won two Academy Awards for its music and the Golden Globe Award for Best Motion Picture, Musical, or Comedy. Oh, I just can't wait to be king. And in 1997, a Broadway adaptation of the film opened and won six Tony Awards, including Best Musical. John Favreau directed this 2019 photorealistic film. Disney was happy to have him at the helm due to the massive success of his reimagining of The Jungle Book, released in 2016. We're wondering if we can expect a shot-for-shot -shot remake of The Lion King. One of its trailers is a perfect echoing of the original 1994 Lion King trailer. The story of the original film centers around Simba, a lion cub who is set to inherit the king's throne from his father Mufasa. Scar, Mufasa's brother, was next in line before Simba's birth. After losing his grasp of the power seat, he becomes envious and vengeful against his family. He hatches a plan with a pack of hyenas to attain the power that he so desperately craves. Simply why I'll be king undisputed, respected, saluted, and seen for the wonder I am. Yes, my teeth and ambitions are bad. Be prepared. So he puts his nephew Simba directly in harm's way to steal his position in line. Mufasa, Simba's brave and protective father, rescues his son. As Mufasa is trying to escape from the gorge, Scar betrays him, ultimately accomplishing his goal. Scar places the blame on Simba for his father's death and convinces him to leave his family and Pride Rock behind. Along his journey of survival and self-discovery, Simba meets Timon and Pumbaa. It means no worries for the rest of your days. Yes, say it, kid. It's our problem free. After some time, Simba is an adult lion and has thoughts about his destiny. Now an adult, Nala ventures off to hunt, and during her pursuit, she and Simba happily meet again. It's like you're back from the dead. You don't know how much this will mean to everyone. Rafiki discovers Simba is alive and guides him to communicate with his father's spirit. Look inside yourself, Simba. You are more than what you have become. He then decides it's time to return home and reclaim his rightful place as king. As you wish, your majesty. <laughs> and of course, he must go through his uncle Scar to do so. When he succeeds against Scar, he breathes life back into the Pride Lands. And all is good again. This epic retelling of the Lion King story is packed with major stars voicing the characters that we love. Donald Glover is the lead as the adult Simba. Beyonce stars as adult Nala, Simba's childhood friend and love. James Earl Jones is reprising his role as the almighty King Mufasa. He's the only cast member that remains the same from the 1994 film. Alfre Woodard is Queen Lioness Sarabi of Pride Rock. Chewie Attell Ejiofor is the villainous Uncle Scar. John Connie is the wise and spiritual Rafiki. The top three hyenas, Azizi, Shenzi, and Kamari, are played by Keegan-Michael Key, Eric Andre, and Florence Kasumba. Billy Eichner and Seth Rogen are the fun-loving duo Timon and Pumba. And last but not least, John Oliver is wise Zazu, Mufasa's trusted confidant. The original Lion King was cherished for its original songs. So we're wondering what kind of musical numbers can we expect? Are we getting new melodies? Any new lyrics? The version of Akuna Matata that's in the movie, like, was all of us in a room this this far away from each other, just like singing at each other's faces, yeah. kind of. Um, 
And yeah, like, as someone who is not the greatest singer, like, it's like having to play basketball with, like, LeBron James, and it's just like, I felt like a fool. <laughs> with the return of mega composer Hans Zimmer and the new addition of super producer Pharrell Williams, the film is definitely in good hands. And let's not forget these songs are performed by the sweet crooner Donald Glover and Queen Bee herself. What excites you most about this new Lion King? Let us know in the comments below. All right, so now you know, and now you can go see the new and approved The Lion King in theaters July 19th.